Bell Sounds in those two. One in black and one in white. Draws a clear cut line. Wearing the white mask is the man who would wear the white hat if he was in a cowboy suit. And that is Mr. Wrestling number two. One of the truly great international stars in the wrestling game. And his opponent is the grappler number two. And the Mr. Wrestling who is the focus of all of the attention of the fans the, in, in this match. This is his first appearance in the Sam Houston Coliseum. Mr. Wrestling 2, of course, has been prominent with people who follow wrestling on the East Coast in Atlanta and Tampa and some of the other, other spots in the South. And he has a style all his own. Fans, when they know two, they keep sounding off two, two, two. He responds to them. He knows their call. He knows enough to stick with everything he does in that ring. He, he doesn't go around currying the favor of the fans. He's a great star. But he, he, and he makes friends. That's two. We've got a bunch of youngsters celebrating birthdays here tonight. Jimmy Thompson. 10 years old. Tiffany Johnson is 10 years old. Kendra White, 10 years old. Tara Renee Fontenot, 8 years of age. Clarence Living is 12. And LaSonia Jones is 10 years of age. Greg Gray is 10 years today. And they are all celebrating here at Houston Wrestling's extravaganza number three. And we tell you that we're th happy that these people have picked Houston Wrestling as the place they wanted to celebrate and welcome them next year at the same time. So Mr. Wrestling 2 with his method of confusing his opponent and he has won an awful lot of matches with his ability to twist and turn things to his own way of doing. Grappler number two, watching wrestling number two. And as they come to grips, watch the movement of those hands because wrestling two is famous for his ability to point in one direction and move in another and to make a man think he's got him sewed up tight and then come out with a well-planned Maneuver, test, strength mostly, leverage coming into it right now as they come down close to the canvas and two's in charge. He is for sure. And he landed hard on the outstretched fingers of number two and that's the reason for doing it here at the Sam Houston Coliseum next Friday night, we've got some great action. Mil Mascaris going to be in there against gorgeous Gino and a feud settler, and we're going to hang Tully Blanchard from the rafters here right up into the ring lights in a varmint cage where he cannot, he cannot interfere as he did at the end of the last meeting between Mill and Gino. We've got girl wrestlers here on our super holiday card that comes the day after Thanksgiving. We've got battle for the Southwest title. Tully Blanchard will get his chance to wrestle next Friday night. We're not denying him that, but he will get his chance to wrestle. He'll go after the title held by Dick Slater. So as wrestling number two is caught in a side headlock, the twist and the turn being put on by A man who knows how to do it, but a man who also knows how to get out of trouble. That's Ch uh, grappling number, uh, rather <laughs> wrestling number two. I got the numbers mixed up here, places, but the but that's wrestling number two with that Japanese arm lock, and he was maneuvering well toward what he's doing right now, taking him down, getting him close to the canvas, giving him something to worry about. Top man, wrestling two. 
Five minutes. Five minutes have gone by. Ten minutes remain in this match as two holes, the front headlock and the The, the, the grip is strictly twos to hold or to change, but there's, there's a lot of power in that. He caught him going back. He was going back for another charge, but before he could get set for the charge, he just went right along with him and pushed him all the way back. A lot of great stars do here in the future. Wrestling 2 is one of them. Next week, Leilani Kai is going to take on Princess Victoria in a girls' match. Leilani Kai being the Hawaiian-born girl who has caught on in a, in a big super way. Oh! The hole in the mask. And I want to tell you, he pushed it right back in that time when he landed that set of knuckles flat up against it. You see, you see the twi the effort to get after the the hand and the twisting of the fingers. The, there's the twisting arm lock that turns it around. Double wrist lock for number two as he went for the traditional use of it to get down into a head scissor and hung right on. Number two trying to squirm up to his feet, get into a balanced position. He may be able to force those knees apart. He did. He got his legs, his head out of the legs and oh, that's doing no good. Now that rush by number two, wrestling number two that is, was for the opportunity to throw his famous explosive knee lift as he raced across that ring. He was prepared to drive it in there and he does it with a wild snap when he, when he does. It's a great blow. Side headlock. There's the turn, the twist. And knocked him with a shoulder butt. Oh. You try the same thing twice on on wrestling too, and you wish that you hadn't. Man outside, grappler number two. Up against the ropes is wrestling too and grappler comes in to aim but he doesn't phase the veteran and oh right a solid smash in the kisser and he laid it in there and laid it hard Here comes, here comes the crowd hollering two, two, two. And grapplers on top. We could have a fall. There's one, there's two. And he just corkscrewed out of that. He just moved that body around there with a deftness that was nice, nice to watch. Now we've got two underneath again. There's one, there's two. And two gets out at two. And again comes the noise for two, two. Now, watch the Wiley wrestling, wrestling too as he, as he starts shifting around there. He's looking for the opportunity to corkscrew into it. Setting him up. Wrestling too is concerned. So number two, crotch hold, lift, slam, and he's top man, but not for long. 
And as the grappler squirms around, he is set up and dropped. Oh, that was Watch out for the knee lift. Watch it. Watch it. Oh. He knows how to get that leg under there. He is great at driving it home. Number two. We'll be back in a moment.